Taking forward one haircut at a time. Today, local high school girls get a lesson in giving back by donating their hair. 113 students at Mount Notre Dame mm -hmm. High School all plan to get a haircut for cancer patients. Local 12's Perry Shively is live in Reading with more on why they want to help. Good morning, Perry. Good morning to you, Sheila. You know, sometimes to a high school girl, who, how you look is who you are. You know, they're just in the process of building their confidence. But today here at Mount Notre Dame High School, the girls are going to learn that it's about much more than that. How you feel is much more important than how you look. 113 girls here have made the pledge to donate at least eight inches of hair to beautiful lengths, a, co a collaboration between the American Cancer Society and Pantene. They'll start cutting hair around 730 this morning, and that hair will be used to make wigs for cancer patients across the country. It takes eight to 15 ponytails to make one wig, and this is a decision that doesn't come easily for all of these girls. For some, it's been a two year your commitment to grow their hair. Yes, my hair is important to me, but I feel like it's so much more important to somebody who doesn't have any. I can just grow more. I can keep donating. I always have, you know, this endless supply of hair, but somebody who's lost all of their hair because they have cancer, they don't have that same opportunity. I think it shows just how wonderful like the MND community is that we have the awareness that, you know, cancer happens and it happens here and it happens to it can happen to anyone that, you know, we're that aware that we know that we can make a difference even if it's just by donating our hair. And the first girl you heard from there, Caroline, get this. This is her fourth time donating. She actually already donated her hair last week at the Night for the Fight, which is for pediatric cancer. Some other girls did that as well, and they'll be honored here today during the hair cutting ceremony with their fellow students. Now, students here also have additional incentives to participate and get their hair cut or to donate. Some of the male staff members here have said that they will color their hair if they get a bigger crowd than they have in the past. Sheila, back to you. Thanks a lot, Perry. Mount Notre Dame has been working with Beautiful Links for five years, and yeah. this event's held every two years to give the girls enough time to grow their hair. Yeah, and uh, in 2015, which was the last time they did this, more than 90 girls donated more than 720 inches of hair. That's fantastic. Yeah, it is outstanding.